Happy November everyone! It's Turkey Month and it's also the last month for our Fall Sports In Conference. But let's go over what they did last week on the Rainbow Roundup. In electrifying matches over the weekend, Rainbow Wahine Volleyball swept Long Beach State and Cal State Fullerton to improve to 13-1 in the Big West Conference. Against the beach, rookie Kaylin Alexander led Hawaii with 11 kills while adding four digs, a pair of service aces, and a block. Riley Wagner also had a great match, finishing one kill shy of notching a double-double, putting down nine kills with 10 digs and a few assists. Against Fullerton, Ember IGD recorded match highs of 15 kills along with four blocks. It marked her 20th double-digit kill match of the season. Tiffany Westerberg also posted a match high hitting percentage with 8 kills on 13 errorless swings. The Rainbow Wahine will now head back to Southern California to take on UC San Diego and UC Irvine. The action starts in San Diego on Friday at 5 p.m. Hawaii time. Well, Saturday didn't go as planned on the road at Fresno State and we'll leave it at that. But your Warriors have three games left in the 2022 season, including two more home games beginning this Saturday when they host Utah State for military night at the Clarence DC Chain Complex. Beach Volleyball is back in action after concluding competition at the ABCA Fall Collegiate Beach Championship in Huntsville, Alabama. Kylan Loker and Jamie Santer had a stellar weekend going 3-0 in pool play and making it to the round of 16 of the champions bracket. The Beach Bows are heading back to Queens on Thanksgiving weekend, hosting UCLA in a two-day event starting on Friday the 25th at 1 p.m. Men's tennis has officially concluded their fall schedule after their final day at the UH HPU Invitational. Andy Hernandez proved to be a force throughout the weekend, winning all three of his single matches against the Sharks. The spring season is right around the corner and the Bows will be opening it up at the UH Tennis Complex against Florida State on January 7th. Tuesday night was a tune-up for Rainbow Wahine basketball as they took care of HPU in exhibition action 73-49, but tonight is the real deal. UH begins the season on the road with the game tonight at Oregon State, followed by a visit to Portland on Wednesday. Both games will be streamed live and you can find the links on Hawaii WBB on Twitter. Men's basketball is back and ready for action as they open up their season with an exhibition match beating UH Hilo 87 to 71. The Warriors shot 61 perfect from the field and went 13 of 28 from the long range. Noel Coleman left off right where he started last year with a game high 28 points. Kamaka Hepa added 11 points and 6 rebounds and lastly Juan Munoz finished with 16 points in just 20 minutes. But the night ended on a sour note with injury to Munoz's Achilles that will sideline him for the season. Heal up fast, Juan. We're all rooting for you. The Bows will officially begin the regular season by taking on Mississippi Valley State on Friday at 7 p.m. Hawaii time at the Simplify Arena in the Outrigger Rainbow Classic. Before we go, we want to give a huge shout out to Irene Gonzalez, a 2019 water polo alum, for helping her home country of Spain claim their first ever FINA World League Championship win on Sunday. I'm Emily Cervantes, and this has been your Rainbow Roundup.